Hi everyone, it's Professor Hall. Welcome to week seven. So uh, everything this week is in your folder, module folder that is labeled midterm under the content tab. Now you might be thinking, Professor Hall, this is a series. Why are we having midterms week seven? For two reasons. Number one, uh, it fell nicely <laughs> in, in the schedule that I wanted. To have. And number two, I find that sometimes uh, your other midterms are in week eight, and then you have way too much going on and you don't have enough time to really do well um, on what I'm asking you to do. So you're having it a week early. <laughs> That's basically it. I hope it helps a little bit, I guess. Um, so I do have lectures for you on reading a poem and writing a literary argument. If you haven't taken writing about literature, uh, one, English 124 with me, or if you haven't taken in a long time, I highly recommend that you watch these lectures before attempting the essay because they really lay out um, how you can read a poem, how you can interpret a poem, and then how you can write an analysis in a really cohesive way, building your literary argument. Um, but they are optional. In terms of reading, you're going to be comparing a poem from County Cullen and a poem from Langston Hughes. You cannot write about any of the ones you had for your journals, nor can you write about the Madame poems that we looked at last week, but the rest are all open. So you just choose whichever speaks to you and whichever you think has enough in there to do a good comparison. Um, so nothing technically to read, uh, optional, videos to watch if you feel like you need the extra help. And then to do, you just have the midterm essay. This is center. It is free. They're open almost all hours of the day. You can go in for personal help or you can use the online system. So uh, that's linked in our course or you can just look it up on the website. It's free and <laughs> not enough people use it, in my opinion. So if you do the essay and you feel like you need another set of eyes on it, or if you get stuck while you're doing the essay, this would be a great place to uh, to get some extra help. So that's it. If you run into any problems, have any concerns or questions, just let me know. As always, you can email me uh, and I'm available for questions. That's it. Have a great week, everyone.